Hello everyone, today we are going to discuss a very important and often overlooked specialization in India and that is MD Geriatric Medicine. If you are considering this branch or if you just want to know about its career scope and job opportunities in India and abroad, then this video is for you. Now what is Geriatric Medicine? So Geriatric Medicine is the branch of medicine that deals with the healthcare of elderly patients and with the aging population which is rapidly increasing in India and worldwide. So geriatric specialists are becoming more and more important. Now, these specialists, they manage the chronic illnesses, polypharmacy, dementia, Parkinson's, rheumatoid arthritis, osteoporosis, fragile uh, uh, conditions, rehabilitation of these patients, and also palliative of, or what you call as the end of term care. So this is a very holistic and patient centered branch, and it is not limited to one organ system or uh, one particular illness, but it is rather focusing on the elderly as a whole. The future of MD geriatric medicine is very bright. Why? Because the elderly population is growing faster than the younger population. We all know the demographics of India that more than 60% population is right now in the middle age and in the next 10 years they are going to come into the old age. India is projected to have over 300 million elderly by 2050 with lifestyle diseases, dementia, longer life expectancy. Geriatricians will be indispensable in both India and abroad. Coming to the job opportunities in India. So in India, you can join a government hospital or a private medical college as a faculty member and as a consultant in government setups also like AIMS, PGI or other state medical colleges. You can join the corporate hospitals in private sector like Apollo, Fortis, Medanta and those hospitals who have started having a dedicated geriatric and palliative care departments where demand is rising day by day. Then there's one more career option which is very much nowadays rising that is an old age home or a long term care facilities. You know, with a lot of children now uh, going to America and other abroad nations and the parents uh, being left here alone in India. So there's a serious demand of uh, uh, having an old age home or having a home caring facility which is required nowadays. So you can start this business which is very much upcoming that you make a app or a platform where you can provide a long term care facility to the old parents who are staying alone at home, whose children are not here, whose children are somewhere else. And these children, they are staying in uh, developed nations so they don't have any problem in spending money so you know i have come across uh, apps which are providing elderly care at home at uh, humongous prices and the children are ready to pay for that so this is something very upcoming very uh, and especially in the uh, in the metro cities like bangalore uh, bombay delhi so these cities where still uh, you know the concept is that uh, the parents are there but the children have gone abroad and then you know the parents there is nobody to take care of the old parents so this is a one career option that is very much in demand nowadays and it's very much growing also then you can also go into academics and research that is always there you can focus on research opportunities in aging dementia alzheimer's parkinson's on quality of life on preventing geriatric complications then you can also join some ngos and public health programs like many ngos are now working with elderly populations and recruiting the geriatric specialties. You can expect a starting salary of 1 to 1.5 lakhs just after MD and then slowly and slowly it grows and if you have your develop your own setup also side by side then you can make a good amount of money. Then let's talk about the career scope in US or in other countries. Now US and Canada geriatric medicine is a very well established specialty. You will need to clear USMLE or the Canada exams and then pursue fellowship or board certifications. In UK geriatric is a major specialty under the national health scheme with huge demand so you'll need to clear PLAB or MRCP and then you have to enter the high specialty training. In Australia and New Zealand geriatrics is a very high demand skill list and after clearing the AMC exam and meeting the requirements you can work in the hospitals or aged care facilities. Then in Middle East Gulf countries uh, they're increasingly hiring the geriatricians due to growing elderly populations and giving very lucrative salaries. Then there are global NGOs and research institutes like WHO, UN, international aging research bodies. They often seek trained professionals. What will be the salary abroad? It can range from $1 lakh to $2 lakh $50,000 per year, depending upon the country and the level of expertise that you have. So to summarize, MD Geriatric Medicine, it offers a stable, fulfilling and growing career path. In India, opportunities are expanding in the hospitals, academics, community medicine. Abroad, the demand is even higher with structural, uh, structured training pathways and excellent uh, pay scale. So if you are someone who is patient, empathetic and passionate about elderly care, then this is definitely a rewarding specialization. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe for more medical career guidance videos. Drop your questions in the comment box and I'll be happy to answer.